Hello guys, how are you? I'm here in Tamriel because look, looky, looky, looky. I think I'm being attacked, but you know what? That's too bad. Oh, and this too. Oh, heavens. And this too. Okay, this is going to be, oh, and a new, oh, and it's got a frog in a music box. Oh my good Lord. What, I'm being, I'm going to die here. And it was like, I don't care because did you see what is going on today? So today it is shop until you drop day. It's going to be a little harsh. I'm just saying. This is going to be a very expensive day in my life, but I have been planning and saving and doing without a whole lot of things for today. So that's, I can, I can live with this. So the house, we have to find the house. Let, let's go. We're just, we're just going. This is the girl who's going to be living in, in Panther Fang Chapel. She is a new character of mine. She's just a wee baby thing. She's only at level seven. Yeah, a little level seven over here. Um, she is an imperial sorcerer. Her background, however, this, you know, she, look at her name. She's related to the family, okay? This is pretty cool. She's uh, she's quite an important part of my life here, so I gotta get back to leveling her too. But yeah, all of this, this is gonna be, do I have enough to pay for all of this? 18, I do, just. I will be broke, but crowns are on sale. And my birthday is coming up. <laughs> oh my goodness. This is what I ask for every year. I need crowns. Oh my goodness. Oh, no kidding. <laughs> Pretty cool. So we're going to have to have a wee look at this place though. Um, and see, I want to see it with and without furniture before I make any kind of decisions on this. So let's let's have a look. What are the options these days? I have not seen furnished, and that's a lot more money. Oh, God. What are they going to put in here? So, okay, well, these are nice, but I will very soon, I'm sure I'll be able to make them, so that's not horribly important. I just want to, we're just going to have a wee look at it furnished. Those are beautiful, aren't they? Oh, I love that stuff. So, okay, oh, the, the tapestries are glorious that is beautiful look at those oh that may be my favorite tapestry in the game oh that is a pretty thing and i whether or not i'm going to keep this as an actual chapel remains to be seen i don't know i've got a lovely wedding and um like a wedding venue in my um the big oh god the name the name the big the big house the, oh she's the, oh she's been busy oh my good lord you creepy little lady why was i doing all i must have been leveling or doing something for that that seems a bit much at any rate um and what am i looking for housing housing here what is the name of that blasted house the 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 what um this one, the Grand Sigig Villa, my, my civilization museum. I do have a wedding venue and a honeymoon place in there. But I'm, I'm thinking, I've been thinking about ripping out a lot of what I've got in there because I've got a collection of statues I don't have a place for. And I've been thinking if I took out all this other stuff, I could put all statues. And then instead of being a you know, museum of civilization, it would be more like a, a statuary place. I'm not sure what I would call that, but still a museum of art but it would be a museum of statuary specifically so i'm thinking i could turn that into a wedding venue perhaps but on the other hand this is going to be her private home so i've got some decisions to make there about that panther fang fort so we got a fort and a chapel is there any reason that i would want to oh those are pretty um should I? I mean, it's a lot of, that's a lot of extra cash. I'm not sure that this would be worth buying it. I don't know. Furnished. I've got a feeling I'll be able to make all of these things very soon. I can probably make some of them already, so. I mean, it's nothing, 
except for those tapestries, which I admit are pretty epic, and that's not entirely dreadful either. You know what I want to check? Let's have a look here, folks. It is shop till you drop day. Let's look at this and see what those details are. What do we have? We're going to get four of those because I'm absolutely buying this. I know this. Two of these. That's cute. Lovely. Okay. Oh, a Leo and Shrine of the Light, of the Eight. I Two of them. Fabulous. We need two of these. We will get two of these already. Oh, stained glass and oh he's amazing look at him huh. you know what I'm thinking what's the price difference that is 4,000 what is the so the price difference on this house between furnished and unfurnished is three and a half see I'm thinking I buy this unfurnished and then I buy two of those packs. <laughs> yeah, I think so. Because I'm going to be able to make a lot of this stuff. Isn't this stuff great? With the, the you, have you guys watched Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D.? Look, come on, look at this. And if you haven't, I'm not going to say anything about it. You should just go watch it. And then you'll know what I'm talking about. Of course, the paintings in here are epic. And those are going to be pricey to acquire. But... Hmm. It is a good shopping day. If you are thinking about buying this house, I do have um, a complete proper tour of it somewhere in this this uh, playlist. This room up here is going to be her room for music boxes. I have been collecting every music box I can get my grubby little paws on, waiting for the right space and the right character that is going to be into music. I have looked up, you know, every instrument in the game that can be made, uh, dug up with antiquities, bought, begged, borrowed, or stolen. And uh, this is going to be a floor right here, this hall along here, and this is where all the music stuff is gonna be. Can you imagine the sound coming off of that? When they're playing up here, we could be having a ball down here and it's like the orchestra is sitting up here singing to us and all of the music boxes will be going into here as a collection. The lady is into the music, so yeah, I'm happy. I gotta start leveling her again. I've been so busy lately, I've hardly played this game at all. Man, the paintings in here are nice though, aren't they? This is very, very pretty. And the tapestries, oh, look at this, look at that piece, that shelf. Oh, that is lovely. But I could buy two of those packs and not buy this furnished. This is, I'm gonna have to think about this one. I'm gonna have to actually check the prices of some of this stuff on the auction houses or the guild stores. And um, yeah, cause there's a lot of art in here, which is pretty cool. There's a lot of art. Huh. Well, it's just going to be an exciting day. If you play ESO and you've not logged in in a few days, you're going to want to do that today because there's just too much going on right now that is very, very, very exciting. This is beautiful. Okay, let's check this out. Oh, that's a pretty thing. Daw! Look at him! I don't have the sound up. We're going to have to listen, right? Let's check the sound. Uh, settings, audio... Let's see the music. That's the music for the building, but that's okay. Effects, I don't know which ones we need, but turn everything up. And let's check this out again. Well, I'm hearing. I, there it is. I'm gonna buy like three of those. Oh my gosh. That's lovely. And then of course those we looked at, what else do we have? The iron astronaut crates are going on right now. Is there just the one for limited time? What do we have? Ooh! Okay, Grody. Way too noisy. This is why 
I can't do that. <laughs> I can't. Oh, man. Just way too much noise for me. Okay, so the houses are on sale. The Notable Home. Yay. And that is still on sale. If you have not bought that, you have today to get it. And I, I do have a... I, done a two a before and after tours of those so and that like I said there is a tour here the furniture is on sale what do we have these guys which I haven't bought there's no timed ones I think I have all the timed ones oh I don't know who knows I haven't been playing a lot lately I've been so freaking busy I just haven't come in and spent time I come in and get the jobs done but I don't spend time right which is unfortunate so but look at this. This is the day that you don't want to miss. This is a very, very exciting day. And this is the best house ever. So you've met the lady that will be living here. You know some of her plans. There will be balls. Oh, yes. We are going to, this one is going to cost millions and millions and millions of gold to fix because this one's going to be pretty posh gardens outside I think I might move you know put the wedding venue in that chapel because that seems like a good place for it and then I can redo the Sigic Villa so yeah if you do, if you play ESO you might want to log in today folks and uh, I'll maybe I'll record some of this in, in the actual decorating process which will be a while because I'm gonna have to earn about four million gold first so yeah, I know I've been asked how I go about doing that, so maybe I'll just do a few random recordings that are kind of aimed toward getting this thing together. Till I see you next time, guys. Let's live our lives happy and buy every castle you can get your hands on, okay? Just do it. Bye-bye.